Hi friends, welcome to Trending Places. Today we showcase you about Baguio. Baguio is a city in the Philippines' west central Luzon province. Governor William Howe Taft and other authorities advocated the lovely spot set in pine-clad hills at around 4,900 feet as the Philippines' summer capital when the U.S. seized the Philippines in 1898. The Filipinos took to the concept, and Baguio grew into the country's most popular tourist destination, with a plethora of hotels, cottages, and summer houses, as well as excellent air, road, and rail connections to Manila, 160 miles south. However, Baguio ceased to be the official summer capital in 1976, with Manila taking over as the year-round capital. This is the Philippines' upland, pine-covered respite from the heat and dust of the lowlands, albeit it is far from calm. Baguio, Baguio is a university town with one of the highest student populations in the Philippines 2.5 million, as well as a crossroads of hill tribe culture and lowland settlement. For most people, Baguio is the main entry point to the backpacker paradises of Sagada, Banay, and Kalinga in the north. Thousands of jeepneys, taxis, and tricycles are sadly responsible for nearly terrible levels of smog in the city center, and longtime Baguio residents wax wistful about the days before SM Mall spoiled every vista and crowded every street. Away from the congested city core, Baguio is light and airy. The small-scale urban mayhem, nightlife, and booming restaurant scene are quite refreshing if you've just returned from the mountains. Baguio, known as the Philippines' summer capital, is the best place to visit if you wish to escape the tropical heat of the lowlands. Even during the hottest months of the year, the city rarely sees temperatures beyond 26 degrees Celsius, with typical temperatures ranging from 15 to 23 degrees Celsius. Baguio is also home to gorgeous plants that would not survive in other parts of the county due to the climate. You'll be in for a treat when you enter the area, which is also known as the City of Pines, because of the lovely flowers and lush flora. You'll feel as though you've stepped into another realm. Aside from cooling off in the freezing environment, the area has a lot to offer, from lush vegetation and gorgeous parks to distinctive food and souvenirs. Burnham Park, Camp John Hay, and the Baguio Cathedral are some of the city's most famous landmarks. You can choose to be one with nature, ride a bike or a boat, or shop to your heart's content in Baguio's various areas. You may also visit a strawberry farm and pick some fresh strawberries, as well as sample strawberry taho. This mountain resort city in northern Luzon is easily accessible by bus or vehicle, making it ideal for spontaneous road vacations, if you're curious to see what's waiting for you. Explore Baguio and check out why local and foreign travelers alike include this in their Philippine travel bucket list. From luxurious hotels to budget-friendly transitory houses, Baguio boasts a wide range of homestay to suit every budget. Most of these options are easily accessible and close to the area's most popular tourist attractions, so you won't miss out on any of the city's attractions. Baguio Nestled high in the Cordillera Central Mountains, is an excellent destination to visit if you want to escape the heat of the Philippines' lowlands. Camp John Hay, which began as a relaxation facility for American servicemen, has evolved into a full-fledged resort featuring a world-class golf course. Make a point of visiting the city market, where you may find practically anything. Baguio is a major gold mining town, while copper is mined nearby in Mancayan. In the city, there are three universities, the Philippine Military Academy, St. Louis University 1963, and the University of Baguio 1969, originally Baguio Technical College. Camp John He, a recreation camp where Japanese General Yamashita Tomoyuki surrendered to General Jonathan M. Wainwright in 1945, Burnham Park, Asin Hot Springs, and Mount Santo Thomas are among the other places of significance. 
The earthquake that rocked central Luzon on July 16, 1990, caused significant damage in Bagbio. Inc. Bagbio, nestled high in the Cordillera Central Mountains, is an excellent destination to visit if you want to escape the heat of the Philippines lowlands. Camp John Hay, which began as a relaxation facility for American servicemen, has evolved into a full-fledged resort featuring a world-class golf course. Make a point of visiting the city market, where you may find practically anything, just be prepared to haggle. Hope you have enjoyed watching the video. Do like and subscribe. Keep watching all our videos.